Emily, uh, Sarah in California is asking this. Are airplanes safe for babies now that the mask mandate has ended? Talk to us, Emily, about the data about flights and COVID exposure. So if you want to, I found the most helpful way to think about this is to to think about how much your risk has changed. So that question presumes that you were comfortable flying with your kid before. And the question is how much additional risk is it now that, uh, that not everyone is masking on the airplane? The reality is that the ventilation on airplanes tends to be quite good. Even before everyone was masking on airplanes, we did not see a lot of spread uh, on, on airplanes. And so that suggests to me that while there is some small increase potentially in risks associated with airplanes, it is likely to be very small. And within the airport, you will be able to keep your baby distanced away from other people. So if you were comfortable doing this before, combining the fact that your baby is low risk for serious illness from COVID and the fact that the delta, the change in the risk associated with the airplane is positive, but likely very small, I don't think that for many people, this would change their decision. Again, getting back to the individual risk calculations, there may be some people who will say, I was on the edge, on the edge before, and this small increase in risk pushes me to not be willing to do it. That is an individual decision, which some people will choose to make. I think it's helpful to frame it in a way that helps you compare. 